Hi, this is Heidi from Garden Crossings, and we on our website have one quart and eight inch pre-mixed combinations. And you may be asking yourself, you know, what is that and what exactly do I do with those? So I'm gonna go ahead and show you what they are and what you can do with them. So here we have the two different sizes. On the left hand side, that's the eight inch, and on the right hand side is, side is the one quart. Uh, basically, the difference is the size of the pot and the size of the plant when you receive it. So the eight inch container has three plugs in it, and in this case, it's the sunglasses combination. And the one quart container also has three plugs in it. And in this situation, it is the this is the blind love combination. So what do you do with these? So these are different containers that you can place into hanging baskets, planters, window boxes, um, any type of container that you might have that you want to have kind of a ready mix combination in. Also, you may want to plant them straight into the ground. So that's kind of totally up to you um, what you want to do. But right now we have a 12 inch hanging basket that we are going to place one of these one quart containers into. And basically she just dug a hole there right in the middle of the container. She's sticking it in and then she'll wrap the soil around it. And then that will take about three weeks for that to fill out that 12 inch hanging basket and be a beautiful, really full and flowerful container. So if you're like, I don't know, that's a little bit small for me to start with, then you may choose to go with the one gallon into the 12 inch container. So we'll go ahead and show you that as well. So we're going to take the 8 inch combination and we're going to st stick this in the middle of the 12 inch pot as well, just so you can see the difference of what an 8 inch and a quart size will do when planting it. So pretty much what sh I would recommend doing is actually taking all the soil out of that pot because setting it right in there, it's not sitting low enough. So we're going to dig all the soil out to the very bottom of the basket so that way when we set that container in, it should be about flush with the top of the container. So yeah, there, that's perfect. So, and you can see how that eight inch, one gallon size container pretty much has that hanging basket all filled out right here and now, and this is starting to flower. They may or may not arrive in flower, but this particular one does have some flowers on it. And then I would say within just a couple weeks, this is already gonna be trailing over the side of the pot and really putting on a pretty show. So the eight inch is great for larger containers or if you're looking for instant impact where the smaller quart size containers are nice if you're okay with letting your plants grow on a little bit. Also another thing we find that these quart sizes are good for is the window boxes. So a lot of times window boxes aren't very um, deep or wide going back and these will tuck in nicely into the window box. The benefit of these combinations is that there's three plants in one container so that way you get that instant mixed look when you plant it up into your containers or hanging baskets. This is Heidi from Garden Crossings.